spider webs aren't just beautiful, well, unless you're walking through a woods and you're like, step into one and it's all over your face. And uh, by the way, I wouldn't want to step in that spider web. That one is a monster. They're also incredibly useful for learning things that man has been able to develop new inventions and products. So what could we learn from a spider web? Well, I'm going to highlight two examples. Spider webs thread is incredibly thin. You could put 10,000 of them in the width of a single human hair. That's how small they are. Researchers a few years ago were trying to create glass nanotubes. A nanotube would be a, a little hollow tube made of glass, which is so small, single molecules could be passed through the opening in it. Now, there's no way you could cast or drill and make a tube out of glass that small. So here's what they did. They took a spider web's fiber and then they put it in a chamber that coated that fiber with glass about six times thicker than the strand of that thread. Then they took that little glass that had that spider silk in the middle of it, put it in an oven, raised the temperature to hundreds of degrees of centigrade so that it completely carbonized the thread and it disappeared. And now there was a hollow opening inside of that tube. That process is now used to make hollow um, light optical fiber cables that allow light to be transferred through them. And they're even used to separate single molecules of chemicals because that opening is so small. All because we were able to use and utilize what the spider had made. Another invention over in Israel, a very dry region of the world uh, and with not a lot of natural sources of clean water, they have been able to create spider web type structures with that same cross pattern of lateral lines and orbital lines running around it out of a very thin thread like structures, make it in a cone shape. And in the early morning and late evening when there is dew forming and it will follow down the cone shape of the spider web, dropping that water into a collective um, chamber in small area they can collect pure water in very dry regions of the world based on the design of what the spider web has made. See, God has made creation for us to not just enjoy and not just to glorify Him and give Him credit for what He has made, but also to learn from it so that we can invent useful, beneficial products.